another early morning start, waiting for the last team member to catch up so that we can head on out. It's going to be a good day, it's going to be a long day of driving and the laughs already started before the sun even rose. So I've been having a squeaking and it's been driving me mad and I don't know where it's coming from. Because it's a squeak. Have you got any Q20 or QW? Close. I can get out of mine. You said you have a close. And the problem is um, because it's dry and because I think they've turned it the wrong way around when they fix it from the accident, it's squeaking and it's driving me mad. <laughs> so we've pulled into Brantle where I have a bit of a history. And um, I'm walking here and this nice lady attendant says to me, You were here before, I remember your face. This is a history, do you remember the story behind it? No, I'm not uh, sure about the story, but I know that the people in Kenya put the wrong fuel in your bucket, so that's why you came here and there were some guys who helped you that said that you must go to Cape Town because there was something with your baby then. Exactly. Yes. Wow, yes. that was 2019. Yes, it was. I was starting here in June. Oh, really? Yeah, so it was my first time that I'm working here and you arrived here with that problem that Saturday morning. So I remember that day and I remember your face. So yeah, I see. This is the guy who was... That's yeah. a long story for another time and I don't think the time will take long to tell. <laughs> That's amazing. Well done on your memory. That's incredible. <laughs> yeah, you must drive safely. Eh? Thank you. Thank Bye. You. Bye. Uh, not lost, no. Just um, just checking out the other scenery. No, bro. I know my precise coordinates, but I'm not lost. I just don't know where anything is, re where anything is relative to where I am. <laughs> What we're doing is we've just found a, a local goat herder because their water was here and this is private property so we asked him for permission so we're going to wild camp tonight um, and he's just come to give us his horse water so we're going to set up our, our, our campus tonight and we're going to chill thank you um, thank you for a nice little dish and just relax um, and then have a good night's sleep because tomorrow's going to be another long day tomorrow we're heading up to Maun we're going to go to Tabong, uh, Tabong we've got to go to Kaki and then onto the freeway and from the freeway we're going straight up to Maun so we're hoping to be there before sunset, don't want to drive on the dirt on the roads in the Botswana at night, it's just not good so yeah we're really looking forward to chill and just putting our feet up, the weather's incredible and um, sun's got like another hour and we're going to be good to go so thank you.